Hi and welcome to Hands-On Education. This video is about Neil Armstrong and his journey to the moon. Neil Armstrong was an American astronaut in the 1960s. What is an astronaut? Astronauts are trained to travel and explore space. To be an astronaut, you need to know a lot about science, math and engineering, as well as be fit and healthy. Before he became an astronaut, Armstrong was a pilot flying aeroplanes. He always wanted to learn to fly and got his pilot's licence in 1946, when he was 16. The Space Race in the 1950s and 1960s, the Soviet Union and the United States of America both wanted to be the first countries to get a man into space. In 1961, Russian cosmonaut Yuri Gagarin was the first man to enter space. He orbited around the world before landing safely back on Earth. Gagarin travelled in a Vostok 1 spacecraft and was in space for 108 minutes. Armstrong became an astronaut in 1962. Neil Armstrong was chosen alongside astronauts Buzz Aldrin and Michael Collins for a journey to the moon. On the 16th of July 1969, Neil Armstrong and his crew blasted off in their rocket. This was the Apollo 11 mission. It took them four days to fly to the moon. They finally landed on the 20th of July, 1969. That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. These were Armstrong's first words when he stepped onto the moon. Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin walked around the surface of the moon and performed science experiments. They brought some samples of rock back to Earth with them. The astronauts left an American flag on the moon to show they had been there. Neil Armstrong also left his footprint on the moon. There is no wind or rain to wear the print away, so it remains there today. Armstrong did not go back into space after this journey, however he continued to fly aeroplanes. In 2012, Neil Armstrong died. From this mission, scientists were able to learn a lot about the moon. Ten more people have been to the moon since Apollo 11. We continue to learn about space today. Would you like to go to the moon? Why? A timeline shows the order of events in history and helps us to understand why things happened when they did. For your hands-on activity, use pictures to create your own timeline, showing the order of events leading up to Neil Armstrong's journey to the moon. For more information about this activity and more activities related to Neil Armstrong's exploration of space, please go to handsoneducation.com. Year 1, Neil Armstrong. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe and we will see you soon. Bye.